Okay, welcome back to another episode. Today we have Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link for the NES. This is one of those amazing gold copies. Uh, these are hard to find. Every Zelda game is getting uh, pricey, and I'm glad I have this. This copy is really nice, as you can tell. Box is pretty much perfect. I think the cartridge is really nice. So, yeah, really excited to get through the unboxing here. This game I did play as a kid quite a bit, actually. But from what I recall, a uh, pretty tough game. I don't think I got too far. Uh, the side scrolling was pretty tough. I did enjoy it. Uh, I think there's a few people out there that didn't like it. You know, they, they introduced that uh, side scrolling mechanic to this game, but I, I, I had fun with it. So you got that window there so you can see the gold cartridge, the shiny cartridge in the back. You got this well detailed sword here. Look at that handle, some gems in it. Look at that sword, the blade there, looking pretty wicked. And then you got another journey of ultimate challenge in the fantasy world of Hyrule. So pretty, pretty basic cover here. Let's take a look at the back here. A couple of screenshots. Of course, it does have the top down overworld here where you go between caves and towns and different levels. You got some enemies on screen there. So classic look there from the first game. Here's the side-scrolling part I was talking about. In town, you talk to people, you fight uh, bad guys in caves and stuff, so that was a lot of fun. Here's the description. The land of Hyrule is in chaos. As Link, you'll be sent on a treacherous journey to return six precious crystals to their origins and six stone statues. Not gonna read it all here. You guys can take a look if you want. Pause the video. Let's take a look at the inside. Look at this. Absolutely beautiful gold cartridge here. Look at that later. What else we got in here? Instruction booklet, also gold. Take a look at this first, really quickly. Look at this, the story of the adventure of Link with some cartoon uh, kind of comic depictions. Love this. You know, they, I'd say it time and time again, they don't put nearly as much love in the instructions. If there are even instructions, Xbox games nowadays don't even come with instruction booklets. So here's the overall map of Hyrule. Starting the game, plains, caves, desert, forest. So these are all the different types of areas that you can explore. As you can see, a lot of side scrolling in these. Not sure if you can see that, yeah, graveyard. Scary section of the game. You can uh, go around in towns and talk to people. They give you helpful information. They move around and stuff. Pretty cool stuff, you know what I'm saying? So pretty in-depth game here. Sticking to the RPG elements. Love that. There's the instruction booklet. Let's get on to the cartridge. Look how minty fresh this cartridge is. That shiny gold finish. Check out the back here. Look at that. Absolutely mint condition. Open it up here, take a look at the circuit board. There you have it, pretty jam-packed on this board, guys. And that's it for the unboxing. Let's get into a quick review. Oh, 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 wow. Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. So classic, this intro brings back so many good memories. Playing as a kid. Never really got far, I think it was a little too difficult for me, just like Ninja Gaiden 2. But let's get on into it, here we go. Jeff times three, we're going to early early level here. Uh, you got jump, you got shoot. I thought there's a few more op, uh, abilities, but you might have to learn them later on the game. Oh, okay. So this is what I forgot, you got some wild battles here, kind of like Pokemon. The side scroll in action. Pretty cool. Not gonna lie, and I'm out. Look at that. So, like, just like Pokemon, man. They, they, Nintendo was way ahead of its time here. Oh! Look at this level. Oh! We got guys with spears here. Ow! This kind of scared me too as a kid. I remember that battle scene. Just too intense for me. Oh, look at this. First town. Let's check it out. Can I read? B button to read. 
town of Ruto, okay. Talk to her. Sorry, I know nothing. <laughs> That's too funny. Oh, look at here. This is their famous I am error. Oh, I forgot about this. Totally forgot. Look at that. Awesome. Super happy we ran into that guy, actually. Do not go south without a candle. Do I have a candle? Looks like I got a candle. Let's go. Alright, we're heading south. We found this cave. And... Candle, so... Oh! Oh! What the? Okay, so they jump and shoot. You can block with your... Look at that. Boom. Boom, boom. Damn! You gotta... Really react with that shield, yo. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Look at this guy. Oh, he's got a boomerang, yo. Damn. Jeff got wrecked. Luckily, we got uh, two more lives here. Oh, damn. This guy really don't fuck around. I'm just gonna run past him here. Okay, maybe I won't. Jeff's only got one life left. How many hits does he take? Oh my lord. Do I have potions? Can I heal myself here? I'm done. I'm a goner. What's this? Give me this life. Is it life? I need life. I need life. How do you find life? I just killed myself. It's already game over, like, it's how hard this game is. <laughs> he's got a laugh in your face when you die, too. And look at look at where he spawned. At the start, I no wonder I didn't play much of this game as a kid. I couldn't, I can't deal with that. Just beat on him when I can. Yes! I made it across, guys! With one hit! All that for nothing. Is there something I'm missing, guys? Oh, it's a super jump! Okay! Super jump. Look! I made it out of the tunnel. And look, I get zero seconds to even breathe here. I'm out of here. I don't care. I'm out. I need a save point. I need a checkpoint. I need something. This game is just too much. Too much going on. There's just too much going on on this game. That's what it is. Look at this. How is someone, anyone, ever supposed to dodge that? Please tell me. I hate Ganon, I hate that guy. I hate this game. I give up. That's it. The game is fun, it's tough. It's too tough though. And uh, in my opinion, even though this one's got a soft spot in my heart, I hate this game. Too difficult, way too much going on. Enemies are just uh, too overpowered. I must be missing something. If you think I'm missing something, let me know in the comments. Maybe there's a strategy or something, but uh, yeah, I don't know how to play this game, and frankly, I don't think I ever will. That's my uh, personal opinion on the game. Hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you in the next episode. Peace out.